Welcome back to the show, feeling festive about Farnsfield and merry about Mapperley. Here to chat about your glorious home county tonight are two terrifically talented talkers. This man's got more tunes than the Christmas choir at St Mary's Church. DJ Skillmaster, aka Martin Stack. <laughs> uh, and all this man wants for Christmas is an end to single use plastic. <laughs> Eco activist <laughs> Liam McClellan. <laughs> Uh, now look, Martin's got a new track on the boil. This man is always working on classic party tunes to get the dance floor at Squares jumping. This one's called Heroes. I think we can hear a little bit. Um, Martin, this is different. It's got a quite it a message, hasn't it? Well, this one was for film and TV, to be honest. Um, but someone said, can you write something about Heroes? And I, and I was thinking, well, so Chaz. And they said, well, those are in the emergency services, those in the army. And, uh, and like you said earlier, it's this time of the year, isn't it? There's loads of people out there working that I would say are heroes, but it's not just those in the in the army and the emergency service, it's those like that guy working through Christmas at the petrol station that's there 24 seven for us, those in the small shops, the AA people and you know emergency breakdown. There's loads of people out there that are heroes and we just need to recognise them sometimes. And we can be a hero, can't we, if we want to be. <laughs> that's the nice thing and I think, I think it's interesting that I think both Boris Johnson, who we saw earlier in the programme, and Jeremy Corbyn have both stood up and said, these are the people, the NHS, the, the doctors, the mm. nurses, the people working in transport, the armed forces, people who are oh, hundreds of, of miles yeah, away from yeah. home this Christmas. It, it, it really is something. Is there anyone who stands out to you, Liam? Um, definitely NHS. Like, I used my GP this morning, and knowing that you know there was someone there on Christmas Eve, you know, the staff are all there, you know, still feeling festive, you know, still being really supportive and really helpful. Um, so yeah, definitely the NHS. What was the experience of this like then, of doing something that's maybe, I'd say, a different genre, I'd say, for you? Mm, it is, it's, it's a challenge as well, because obviously people tend to pigeonhole you and think you only do a certain style, but I like, to, I, I like to think I can do a bit of everything, to be honest. I'm not an expert at everything, but I'll have a go. Jack of all but, trades. A jack a of all trades. Of all trades. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, but, but like I say, for Cap Records, they off, I've done a lot for them for film and TV, and, and, and things have flowered in that direction. So for me, when they said, can you do something for Heroes, I said, leave it with me. And, and we've sent it and they love it and hopefully in the new year we'll be telling you where it landed up. So Can you give us a clue? Uh, well, I don't know, I mean like I said it's all, <laughs> it's there, it's ready to be, it's ready, it's ready to go, all I can say is that. But and as we speak now, uh, my partner in crime Mark Gamble, he's working on another track we're doing which is a cover version of a big dance anthem that I won't say, to, once that's completely finished I'll let you know on that one. Can't wait, look it's <laughs> nice to see something different, it's Ooh, nice to have music. a positive message. Yeah, yeah. it is, but, but everyone can be a hero, that's true. Absolutely. Make a difference in your community. Definitely. Uh, look, the, uh, the general election.